2 Thessalonians 2 and 10. And with all deceivableness of unrighteousness in them that perish, because they receive not the love of the truth, that they might be saved. And for this cause God shall send them strong delusion, that they should believe a lie. Yeah, that's good on that. You got something you about to bring out? Second Ezra 16 and 5, 4. A fire is sent among you, and who may quench you? That's that fire. That's that fire and brimstone. You know about fire and brimstone? That's talking about nuclear destruction. The soon there's gonna be World War III's gonna break out, and Russia gonna start shooting missiles on America. That's gonna be beautiful, man. Keep going. Plagues are sent unto you. Plagues, we've been talking about the plagues all night. Cannibalism, diseases, viruses. Keep going. And what is he that may drive them away? May any man drive away a hungry lion in the wood? Or may anyone quench the fire in stubble? So there is no stopping the prophecies of the Most High. This destruction is coming. Keep going. When it had begun to burn. So the Lord already uh, determined that America was going to be destroyed before the earth was even created. It was all set up. The script was written from the beginning. Keep going. May one turn again the arrow that is shot of a strong archer. Yeah, in the modern day arrow is a missile. And that's strong, it's a strong archer, not a, it's a, a strong archer. That's talking about those missile silos. Okay, there ain't no stopping those missiles. Okay, you can't, you can't stop those millions of Russian missiles. And all, all the other countries, they're going to shoot missiles on America too. <coughs> China going to be shooting missiles. Japan going to shoot missiles. Everybody going to shoot missiles on America. It's going to be beautiful. Going. The mighty Lord sendeth the plagues, and who is he that can drive them away? A it, fire. It, yeah, you ain't stopping those missiles. You ain't got no missile defense system that can stop that many missiles. Yeah, Russia got a new missile they coming out with. They got stealth missiles. They got missiles that can't be detected. You know what I'm saying? They got stealth technology. That's crazy. Nuclear missiles with fucking Yeah, and, and Russia has they have the most advanced stealth jet fighter plane on the planet. Usually, almost all of Russia usually have the best military shit, bro. A fire shall go forth from his wrath. And who is he that can quench it? He shall cast lightning. And who shall not fear? He shall thunder. And who shall not be afraid? The Lord shall threaten. And who shall not be utterly beaten? He gonna beat y'all to the Lord gonna beat y'all to powder. This is we, we read out the Holy Bible, man. Powder. So we telling you, the same as gonna, if you don't Ash. believe that, that means you don't believe the Bible. You know, you can just blow it. Yeah, you just blow it. Powder, ash, It's gonna be, yeah, powder. That's what it's gonna be after that that great heat. Y'all turn to ash, you get cremated. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Your ass gonna get cremated. You can be able to fit inside of a jar. And what did second ass? What did Ezra see okay. after the the, the 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 fire and the tempest? He all he can recognize is smoke and smoke and ash. Just like that. That's that smoke. everlasting fire, everlasting, everlasting destruction. Mm -hmm. That's what that is. That's that. That's that fire. That's from that great destruction. The earth quaketh, and the foundations thereof. The sea arises up with waves from the deep. And the waves of it are troubled, and the fishes thereof also, before the Lord and before the glory of his power. For strong is his right hand that bendeth the bow. Yeah, that's a strong hand. His yeah. arrows that he shooteth are sharp and shall not miss. Them arrows ain't gonna miss. Those missiles are not gonna miss. They were designed to, to strike their target. But you, how can you miss though? They got one nuke. No, man, you ain't got to be precise with the nuke. You can just hit in a general area. They got nukes that can blow up a whole state. Yeah, it don't have to be even near the target. Yeah. It doesn't even have to be near the target. And plus, when you got hundreds of nukes, and millions of nukes, you got the sky covered in nukes. Mm -hmm. Remember like in that movie 300 and the sky was covered in arrows? Ooh, it, it's it's going to be like nukes. that, but it's going to be missiles. missiles. Yeah. It's going to be covered with missiles. And all those missiles are gonna cause a great destruction, man. The earth is gonna uh, wobble like a drunkard. We gonna get that scripture. Is that Isaiah? Yeah, I get it. Um,
but I mean his arrow that he shooteth are sharp and shall not miss when they begin to be shot into the ends of the world. Behold, the plagues are sent and shall not return again. Oh, wait. Find your seat, brother. <laughs> <laughs> the fuck was that? And they come upon the earth. I'm glad he didn't say it. Any, any, any man that has hair like any man that has hair like that, I ain't messing with you. You can tell he was a Rastafaria. He had hair like Brandy or something. Like, a, uh, <laughs> like Monica. These niggas be getting extensions and shit too. Wear yeah. they wear like women do they get extensions too they wear lipstick yeah, too be, mm -hmm. be, eyeliners wear tights they do wear eyeliners and, and my daughter got bees in her ear right right <laughs> the fire is kindled and shall not be put out till it content consume the foundations of the earth like as an arrow which is shot of a mighty archer return not backward even so the plagues that shall be sent upon earth shall not return again Woe is me! Woe is me! Who will deliver me in those days? Man, I this, got some more. This, this is Isaiah 24. 24. I don't know if I, I want to read that whole chapter too. Right, right. But I'm so, like, she just got pounded. Let me just go straight to the point. I'll go ahead. What's your, you got something you want to get? I don't know if I'm... What you got? Let me read this while y'all getting that. Yeah, 24 and 18. Yeah, I'm gonna read this part first. Okay. Isaiah 24 and 5. The earth also is defiled under the inhabitants thereof. Like it's defiled out here. None of y'all people follow the laws of the Bible. You're a bunch of faggots and weirdos. All the men look like a bunch of little girly men. They're all soft and weak. You know what I'm saying? They have no spine, they have no backbone. No balls. They have no balls. You know what I'm saying? They're a bunch of bitches. That's the American man is a fucking faggot. The new woman. <laughs> uh, yeah, the new woman. The man is the new woman. That's the new woman. That's yeah. the new woman. It's like the woman, the new man. Yeah, the, yeah. The man doesn't work. The woman goes to work. They don't want men at work. They don't hear the household when she filed taxes. Yep, yep. You know, that's that new thing the Lord created. The Lord created a new thing. You did. That's the amazing. Though. That's, a man. that's really amazing. That's you tell you that in Isaiah. It's very new. What's that? Isaiah uh, three. Yep. The woman should rule the man. That's America. Right? The, the, the symbol of America, one of the symbols is a Statue of Liberty. And that's a woman. <laughs> you know, that's the Queen of Heaven. It actually looks just like Sol Invictus, the sun god. But then, but then again, it looks like a woman, but it really looks like a transvestite. You can't really tell if it's a man or a woman. Yeah, yeah, we went to New York, man. I didn't even want to go see that whore, man. Yeah, fuck that shit. I hope it gets destroyed. It was built by Freemasons. So it's, they taught us that in elementary school, that it was built by Freemasons. And everybody knows Freemasons are devil worshipers. So there you go. The symbol, one of the greatest symbols of America is the Statue of Liberty. What they say is a beacon of freedom. You know, it shows... Who's freedom they talking about? <laughs> yeah, exactly. Who's freedom they talking about? But it was built by Freemasons who are goddamn devil worshipers. Right, they, need, they, they didn't specify who's freedom. So there you go. I ain't never been free since we got so, so you ain't gonna tell me America's a God fearing nation. They worship the devil. It was founded by devil worship. Oh, just like that bitch, the uh, the stenographer, that broke out in the House of Representatives. Oh, yeah, yeah. And she came out and she said, America was never a nation formed under God. It was founded by Freemasons. And she was telling people to repent. <laughs> that dude looks like some mind control shit. I don't know, man. Nah. Who knows? But whatever, that is the truth. That's all I can tell you. That was on point. Yeah, that's. I, I've heard a few different conspiracies on that one. But uh, let me get back to this. Isaiah 24, 5. The earth also is defiled under the inhabitants thereof because they have transgressed the laws. Everybody eats pork. Okay, it's perfectly fine to uh, get a divorce and commit adultery. All these fucking adulterous ass women. They have transgressed the laws, changed the ordinance, broken the everlasting covenants. Therefore hath the curse devoured the earth, and they that dwell therein are desolate. 
Therefore, the inhabitants of the earth are burned and few men left. So there's going to be few men left. So that's, that's the God of the Bible, okay? That's, the, that's what the Holy Bible says. The new wine morning, divine language, said, all the marrieth do sigh. All the marrieth do sigh. They all having a good time. They be listening to their bullshit music. Y'all about to y'all about to cry like some bitches, man. Y'all soon y'all gonna be crying like some bitches. Y'all will be pleading and screaming, praying someone's gonna save you, and nobody's gonna save you. That's right. Said the mirth of Tabra ceases. They're just talking about musical instruments. The noise of them that rejoice of endeth. <laughs> it has beautiful, ain't it? Now listen to this, man. I gotta read that again. The mirth of tabard ceases. That's all them drums, your bullshit, uh, yo, that shit they be bumping in they ride, your trunk shaking, shaking. They gotta be having these janky ass sisters in their car, your whole shit rattling. shaking, rattling. This shit sounds horrible, man. Yo, I, we won't hear none of your bullshit music is garbage, okay? Or destroy that shit. I'll throw that CD out the window. Yo, MP3 player, I'll take it and stomp it. The Lord gonna stomp it, he gonna smash it. He gonna get... Said the mirth of tabard Cephas, the noise of them that rejoice endeth, the joy of the harp ceases. They shall not drink wine with the song, strong drink shall be bitter to them that drink it. The city of confusion is broken down. Because this is Babylon, the city of confusion. They're gonna be looking to get drunk to ease their pain and they ain't gonna be, ain't gonna be working. Yep. Ain't gonna be working. You know what I mean? That's exactly what's gonna happen. The city of confusion is broken down. Every house is shut up that no man may come in. They're going to be terrified. There's also a scripture how they're oh, yeah. going to be committing suicide. They're going to say they, can, they, they seek death suicide. and they ain't going oh, yeah. to find they, it. They, you know, they ain't going to find it. They're going to try they're gonna, they're gonna they're gonna try and blow their heads the off gun, and they're going to misfire. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's some shit. Yeah. Or they brain, yeah. Yeah, shoot themselves yeah. and stay alive. Yeah. Now they're they handicapped. Yeah. Right, right, right. They got to go through this full form. They got vegetables they sell. They got to go through this full form. There's going to be, that's how the Lord just seeks some fucking death. They gonna wanna escape this world. Check this nah, out. Ain't gonna happen. Ain't gonna happen. Watch this one though. This is a good one. There is crying for wine in the streets. All joy is darkened. The mirth of the land is gone. <laughs> it's like that <laughs> party. Yeah. That's that party. Yeah. Yeah. That great party that America's on. They thought it was such a beautiful city. Yeah. Now look at it. And the city is left desolation. And the gate is smitten with destruction. When thus it shall be in the midst of the land among the people, it shall be as the shaking of an olive tree and as the gleaming grapes when the vintage is gone. They shall lift up their voice. They shall sing for the majesty of the Lord. They shall cry aloud from the sea. Wherefore glorify ye the Lord in the fires even in the name of the Lord God of Israel in the isles of the sea. From the uttermost part of the earth we have heard songs, even glory to the righteous. But I said, my leanness, my leanness, woe unto me. The treacherous dealers have dealt treacherously. That's, that's talking about that America's a treacherous place to live. That court system is treacherous. Every time you drive and you look in your mirror or whatever, for the cops, you know, yeah, so you make sure the police ain't around. Like, oh yeah. shit, the cops. Even though you ain't did nothing wrong, you still make sure there ain't no cops around the corner. Right. You always on the edge. Like, I gotta watch out. Gotta watch what I say. You gotta, you gotta be careful. Got your license. Yeah. You got the paper to ride. You still. Yeah. Fuck all that shit. Fuck a driver's license. Fuck all your shit. You can take a driver's license and shove it up your ass, man. What kind of evil shit is that? Well, somebody, I gotta have a. Uh, you gotta get me permission. To operate some, my vehicle, the car that I own. That's just my property. It got nothing to do with you. Me driving my car has nothing to do with another man. How are you gonna have another man telling me what I can do and what I can't do? That's my shit. Fucking bullshit. I got something real quick. I'll go ahead. This is uh, Revelation 9 and 6. And in those days shall men seek death and hey. shall not find it, and shall desire to die, and, and death shall flee from them. Yep. That's how bad it's going to be. Yep. 
That's just the spirit of the Lord. Yeah, the they're going to the wish Lord. to die. The Lord is doing that. That's some angels doing that. They control everything. That's how bad it's going to be. Yeah. You got people like that. I hear people all the time saying, I just want to kill myself. They got to feel this yeah. full blood of the Lord. They got to feel it. They got to yeah. feel it. Yep. You know? No. This battery is about to die. Oh, that's alright. We got a pretty good video, man. Jeremiah 51 and 30. The mighty men of Babylon have forborne to fight. They have remained in their holds. Their might has failed. They become as women. Oh, they become, that's the mighty men of Babylon. Where you at? That's the Marines. Okay. That's the Marine Corps. The Marine Corps has become like women. All, all, now you can be a faggot in the military. You can actually be a faggot. And they become as women. They're in there fucking each other in the ass like that's his bitch or something. Read that again. That's a good scripture. Jeremiah 51 and 30. They really actually like, well, this is prophecy, bro. Look the, at all these faggot ass men walking around. All these feminine faggots everywhere. The mighty men of Babylon have forborne to fight. They have remained in their holds. Their might has failed. <laughs> they became as women. Become as women. All these men out here are like women. Okay. Like, I don't call them girly men. Yeah, girly men. You got people actually call each other bronies. Or like you said, there's a term out now called bromance. You ever heard of bromance? Fuck. Go they ahead. have burned her dwelling places. Her bars are broken. They have a bunch of weak bitches out here, man. I just got this is a bunch of weak bitches. There's nothing else to call it. They're a bunch of weak, faggot ass bitches. They got no, like I said, they're no backbone, no spine. They're scared to do anything. No, 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 it's not tight. Okay. Okay. Have no places to hide. That's right. Because you know really, you gotta be a. Shelters. When you really look at it, you gotta be a bad dude to do the work of the Lord. Because everybody else are faggots, man. Faggots. Scary. You ain't gonna never see none of these weak faggots out here doing the work. They're teaching anybody warning. If they try in front, they're going to get attacked. And then they're going to fight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They get chased the down. That's why I knew. You got to get down. Yeah. 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 They, they, they wasn't doing no work with what we was doing. They, was, they, they wasn't cussing nobody out nothing. They were just holding up signs. Holding signs, yeah. And they, 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 yeah. they, they got beat down. up. They got beat the fuck up. Let me get this too yeah. real quick. The, the Lord's looking for men, not faggots. Jeremiah 30 and 23. Behold, the whirlwind of the Lord goes forth with a, with fury, a continuing whirlwind. It shall fall with pain. A continuing whirlwind. That, that's that. That's that nuclear fire. That storm. It shall fall with pain. That, that's gonna be beautiful, man. I read that again. Jeremiah 30, 23. Behold, the whirlwind of the Lord goes forth with fury, a continuing whirlwind. Oh, that's probably that's talking about the chariots too. The chariots. That's chariots. Yep. Keep going. It shall fall with pain upon the head of the wicked. Yeah, because what well, because when, when the day of the Lord when the day of the Lord comes, man, you're gonna have all kind of destruction. You gotta have missiles flying, but then you're gonna have the Lord is actually gonna come back out the clouds with chariots. Okay, and, and you, you can only imagine the Lord only knows what kind of destruction a chariot can bring on the earth. One chariot. They, 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 you know, you watch movies about uh UFOs like War of the Worlds. And, and, they, and they try to show you what could happen, but no, you can't even imagine the, the power of them chariots. You know what I'm saying? Well, probably one chariot could blow up the whole earth. Yeah, one. Go ahead. Jeremiah 30 and 24. The fierce anger of the Lord shall not return until he hath done it and until he hath performed the intents of his heart in the later days Ye shall consider it. That's why we in the latter days right now. This is the the la the, yeah, the later days, yep, latter. Yep, and it's in his heart is to destroy this motherfucking kingdom. And it's going to be destroyed. Completely. Completely. It deserves to be destroyed. There's going to be a remnant of this motherfucking yeah, kingdom. Yeah, like, that's a good point. No you know remnant. I mean? Ain't going to be no trace. No All trace. You, hey, there will be a trace. You'll see some smoke. Like, yeah, we'll, smoke, yeah. some smoke over. This is going to be smoking yeah, yeah, for a long time. Yeah, big ass, yeah. big ass dope. Yeah. <laughs> the ash you got some scorpions and some buzzards that's all that's gonna live here uh spirits and evil spirits is gonna be over here oh, man imagine that that's why i say ain't no ain't nothing gonna fill up here except for that you may fly over here see what it look like after but i don't think anybody can set a foot on this one